Hi guys, hopefully everyone is doing well today. I'm here with the review and my thoughts on the e.l.f. Volumizing and Defining Mascara. So I picked this up at CVS and I believe I picked it up on a sale and only paid maybe a dollar for it. And I wanted to do a review on it. Um, it says it's new, I'm not sure how new it is, but I picked up the color in jet black and it says that it creates voluptuous lashes that are full and defined, vitamin B and E enriched formula, conditions lashes, the silicone brush effortlessly combs through lashes, coating them evenly for a rich finish. So, my first time using this, I didn't really find that my lashes were voluminous or voluptuous as they say in the packaging, but after me using it over the last couple of weeks, I've noticed that when I do two coats and then wait maybe a minute or so, and then on that third coat, if I just kind of focus it at the base of my lashes and kind of comb it up, then I notice that it kind of gives it a little bit of volume. Not as much volume as I get with some of my other mascaras, but I've really loved to pair this whenever I'm using false lashes. It just kind of, it coats the lashes really well um, and it kind of makes them look more natural. They blend easier with my false lashes like that I'm wearing today. So I'm not gonna do a demo. I am gonna do a demo on my lower lashes because with the look that I did with this Get Ready With Me, I didn't want to put mascara on my lower lash line or my lower lashes but I figured I would do that with you guys today just to show you how it coats and to show you the brush and all that so this is the brush it's kind of a natural hair bristled brush and or is it no, I think it's a, a synthetic um, bristle brush, but it kind of has like this angle to it. I don't really feel like that does anything personally for the lashes, but um, what I do find is the formula is a little bit wet, so when you pull it out, you're going to get a lot of access like you see on the tip there. So just get that off. I'm finding with mascaras lately that's happening a lot. So I'm not sure what that's about, but let's go ahead and get into the demo. So I'm going to just do my lower lashes. It is quite easy to coat the lower lashes. And I didn't find any flaking, smudging, or anything like that with this mascara. I think this is gonna be the mascara that I keep in my purse for on the go days, days that I'm in a rush and I really don't have time to do a full face of makeup and I have to kinda do it on the go. This mascara is perfect for that. And so that's that. I mean, look at how more I guess defined you would say my lower lashes look now that I add the mascara so that's that I mean look at how much like I just said <laughs> um, so I really like this mascara I think for a dollar two dollars at the most I can't remember because I know I got it on sale but I really love this um, mascara. I think if you're looking for a drugstore, something that is inexpensive and that is a good quality, this is one to try. I didn't get the waterproof formula. I'm pretty sure that there, I think it's just this one. I didn't see a waterproof, but it's easy to come off. It doesn't flake or smudge or transfer or anything like that. And I don't know I think this is really good I'm glad to have tried it and it's one of those you know when you see the cheaper mascaras you're like I don't know it might not be as good but this is really good I'm, I was pleasantly surprised with this mascara so um, I think that's everything if you think of anything that I may have left out let me know in the comments below if you have any questions but 
This was an A plus for me. I can't wait to add this to my purse, to my makeup bag as an on the go mascara for this busy mom. So anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this review of this e.l.f. volumizing and defining mascara. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and until my next video, y'all take care. Bye.